What's happening? What's happening? What's happening? Of course, you know it's your boy B Hot Radio. Shout in as always. I got my podcast partner off in this thing. The original hot boy himself. Turk, whoa, what whoa, up? Whoa, dude? whoa, whoa. No sweat, no check, man. You don't really know, man. Getting it in. You I mean, me? you talking about no sweat, no check, but speaking of the check, you and Juvie was up there yeah. picking up checks all up and down the yeah, East Coast yeah, over yeah. the weekend. Shout What's out to my man? big bro, Juve, man. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? That back that ass up to man, doing, man, extravagant, you know what I'm saying? And um, just to be a part of that, bro, like, I just feel so grateful, you know, um, every time I hit that stage, bro, you know, and I'm learning so much, you know, like, I, I watch Juve and I watch Wayne performance, you know, and you know, I don't let them know, but I let Juve know this weekend, like, bro, I'm watching you and I see how you and Wayne kind of, like, interact with the fans. That's how right. y'all, y'all really, like, make it about them. You that's know what I'm right. saying? And that's the element that I was missing that I'm mm. learning from them. And that Juve, like, man, you're going to get it, you're going to get it. But he don't even know I got it because exactly. I've been watching them. <laughs> you know, and, Yum. bro, any artists that's out there, man, get your stage presence together because yeah. these fans, man, you know what I'm saying, they come to see a show. That's you know, right. They don't want to see us just up there rapping a song and it's like they listening to it on their iPad or on their phone. They want to be entertained. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And seeing Juvie with the band, you know what I'm saying? Seeing Wayne, you know, sometimes he bring out the guitar and, you know what I'm saying, how he... And they say the same thing repetitive every time they hit that stage. Yeah. That's a real performer, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So, yeah, man, shout out to Juve and Weezy, bro, you know, because I've been peeping them out and I'm going to be ready for that Louisiana Fest, you did. I mean, how you feeling yeah. about that Louisiana Fest, though, man? I mean, what's happening, what's happening, I'm what's excited. Happening? I'm excited about that, man. Um, The fans, bro, like, you know, they 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 want that, you yeah. know, and they finally get what they want. You know, um, I just thank God, man, from lining the stars up, you know what I'm saying? Because at once upon a time, you know, it was hard and we didn't know if it was gonna happen. Mm -hmm. You know, but inside something was telling me that it will and yeah. it is, you know what I'm saying? Because I have faith, you know, but in the physical, man, it it it, it wasn't even, you know, happening, you know what I'm talking yeah. about? But when when you doing the right thing, man, you know you reap what you sow, and I think that's what's going on, man. You know what I'm saying? The stars all lined up. You know the fans, they 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 spoke out. They say what they said, and you know Weezy put it together. You know what I'm saying? Louisiana Fest, November second, sold out. You know what I'm saying? Um, man, I can't wait, bro. I'm 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 anticipating so much to come from this after that. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And um. Only time gonna tell, bro. You feel me? Now I'm with you on that. Now I mean, in trending topics, you know, it looks like uh, Rollo said, you know what? He's done trolling Boosie. He's gonna yeah. move on from all of the trolling. Yeah. And uh, right when that happened, I mean, Boosie said that everybody's obsessed with him. Yeah. I mean, I don't know what to think anymore. I'm trying to figure out why can't these brothers just yeah, sit yeah. down and figure it out? Hey, you know, sometimes, bro, it don't even be the people. It be the people, you know what I'm saying? Uh, and I can speak from experience, you know what I'm saying, with what with, with, with I had going on, you know. Sometimes you'll say something and then you'll be off it. And then, you know, the next person will see it, but that's a whole week from when you say that you mm. off it, but now they own it because, exactly. you know, it's it's like a, a, a the media won't let it die down mm. unless you sit back and just be completely off it. Even yeah. if you see something later on down the line, man, I'm off of it. Yeah. And that's what you got to do. You got to stand firm on what you what you what you believe that is right the right thing to do man and um that's the approach that i took and um everything just start working itself out bro i feel like you reap what you sow you know what i'm saying and if you really want things to work yourself out you know what i'm saying you got to swallow your pride you gotta let your ego go you know and i know it ain't no bloodshed i know it ain't this man look forget what other people think because that's what it be what other people are gonna think? Ah, oh, he ain't say that, da, 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 da. Mm -hmm. you know what I'm saying? But then once you get over that, bro, where you ain't trying to please people, yeah. you know what I'm saying, man? I'm trying to live. You know, I'm I'm trying to be out here for my family. You know what I'm saying? You gotta put what's important, what's really important. You know what I'm saying? Ahead of your ego, ahead of your pride, and just take care of your business, man. If it ain't gonna affect you down the line, if it ain't affecting you right now, you know what I'm saying, and you know it's not, Yeah, man, let it roll, let it ride, you know what I'm saying? I I, I rock with both of them guys, bro, and, um, you know, 
if they listening to this and if they watching, man, you know what I'm saying? Man, I want them to know that, you know what I'm saying? Man, look, man, it's respect coming from me, and there's a lot more people that got respect for y'all, but y'all won't see it because they're not going to push that. Yeah. So if if y'all was to sit down and be like, man, look, man, that shit over with. Mm -hmm. Man, from the real, real ones, bro, like, that's what we want to see. You know what I'm saying? Reconciliation, man. We want to see peace. You feel me? And get to the money and keep on getting it, man. Keep your freedom. Your freedom is everything. Because you can't get away. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? They watching everything. They listening to everything. And the crazy part, they know that. Yeah. yeah. They not green. They both streets. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They both them been out here. They both them been in the system. You feel me? We all have been in the system. So we ain't getting away. We ain't doing nothing but entertaining these fans who ain't been nowhere where we been at. So either way, they going to go wherever way you go. You feel me? We just got to be willing to just take that stand, bro, and stand on business for real. I'm a fan of both of them, man, but I want to see both of them do, though, is talk about that real estate a lot more. You yeah. see what I'm saying? Yeah. Boosie goes crazy with the real estate, and Rollo goes crazy with yeah. the real estate as well, Give man. up that game. Exactly. Give up the game on that because, yeah. I mean, I think Boosie done built the whole town in the back of his uh, exactly. house for the fam. And exactly. then I know Rollo done flipped the bluff exactly. and bad city into his own little area. I got an idea just from you just saying that. Now, that's the competition. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Hey, oh! hey, who, I, I, I want to compete with you who going to buy up the more land and provide oh more God. jobs for our people. Ooh. You know what I'm saying? Because, bro, I watch both of them guys and I see them they build stuff from scratch. Yep. And I'm like, they got a lot of similarities. You know what I'm yep. saying? Stuff that I trying to do myself. You feel me? Like, man, I watch y'all good. You know what I'm exactly. talking about? And I take from it. You know? So, yeah, bro, that's a challenge within itself, man. Keep on buying up the block, providing jobs for people, and um, giving people like us hope, bro. You know exactly. what I'm saying? Because where we come from, it's hard to get land. It's hard to be owners. It's exactly. hard. That's hard. But y'all got the key to it. You come feel on. me? So, I just, matter of fact, was watching, I believe, it's chapter 32. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And and I was watching um, Rallo, you know, I think he bought his mom a house. Well, this probably was some months back. He probably already built it and stuff already. But mm -hmm. how they was talking about how they um, making everything with the technology and how the yeah. studio going to be led, how the theater room. And, you know what I'm saying? Man, I love that, man. Mm -hmm. What he doing for the kids, you yeah. feel me? And um, just providing jobs for for our people, you know what I'm saying? Like that's that's my respect that. And like I said, you're not gonna have the blogs talking about that, but y'all can talk about that more and continue to educate the people. And I think the blogs will pick it up if they make it a competition on how to real. build up communities to show folks what they really doing in real time too. Because see, that's the other thing we talking about it exactly. And we'll start the conversation for you the if you need somebody to let, start. You see you what I'm saying? Me. It's him. Yeah, but that's what I want to yeah. hear about. That's what I have me following folks on liking posts and yeah. tuning in every five yeah. minutes. Because I like to see that stuff. There's, there's some real live hood HGTV stuff they got going on, and man. That, and to be honest, that's gangster. Exactly. Like, that's gangster, man. You got two brothers coming from the mud. Come on. You know what I'm saying? They made it through the prison system. Come on. You feel me? And doing something productive. We got to shine the light on the productivity, bro. Come on, man. And not the bullshit. You know what I'm saying? And, you know, like, warning come from, I mean, come from people that didn't been there. And signs and symbols is for the conscious mind. Both of y'all are conscious, bro. And y'all know it because I hear how y'all talk. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? And I wouldn't be an OG. I wouldn't be, you know what I'm saying, who I am if I didn't spoke up and say what I say. But at yeah. the end of the day, y'all two grown men, man. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully, man, you know. Y'all will take, you know, the advice and, and make that a challenge. You feel me? Who going to buy up the block? What what Who who buying the next building? Who who giving somebody the next job? You feel me? Like, that's gangster. 